All right, MD-80. This MD-80 is also in a museum. This MD-80 is actually in the C.R. Smith Museum in Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, it's a small museum, but pretty nice. Um, but anyway, so I just wanted to get a chance to show the MD-80. Uh, you've seen my MD-80 video before. A lot of this is familiar. But just to show a couple things how things work, because obviously in that video I couldn't do anything. So the way you would do, you would turn on the APU is you would bring this battery forward. And get this thing to go. Okay, battery. All right. Then you would. Okay, the auto. Of course, you leave this. In, you leave this in auto. Okay. Bring it. Bring this into off. Push it and hold it. So that started, and then you would let go, and it should stay stabilize on its own. All right. That's how you turn on the battery. And then once that was set up. You would have to actually reset the generator, so you would click reset, this goes like that, and then you would see the lights for the buses come on, or excuse me, turn on, this is APU. Okay, these, uh, obviously, they probably pop these out, but the blue lights like these, so you do one, wait about 10 seconds, 5-10 seconds, do the other one, seconds, and then you have everything. Okay, that's turning on the APU for electricity. For the air, very simple. Just turn on this. This was its, basically its bleed air. So on, and you come over here, APU, come here, high power bleed off, or you just leave it in auto, which is probably preferred, and then you can control the air conditioner right there, and you would actually see this mixing valve open and close. Okay? Now that's basically how that would work there. Okay, so of course, same thing, go backwards, turn these off. Okay, turn this off. Okay, so. Off. Let that power down. And then the battery is out. And on this aircraft, the fuel came from the right tank. So if you had a problem with the APU bleed, or the APU fuel, you would turn, if you had external power, so that would be these on. Same procedure as before, five seconds, then we'll go the other one. Then you would turn either one of these on to get fuel for the APU. And that's a rundown of the in basic MD80 operation of how to turn it on. And that's it.